morning everyone today is june <clears throat> the 12th 2024 it is wednesday hump day it is like 6 30 in the morning um i woke up this morning like around four o'clock and i'm like i want to eat a cake i want to take a break from vegetables and all that. I've been eating a lot of good stuff. I've been eating food that like, helps my body and can process it fast. I want something. I want a cake. So I'm like, hmm. What can I eat? I don't have any cake. So I'm like, um, I bought this um, package like, um, all it is is like rice flour and you had to um put other stuff in it. it's already pre-measured so that's a good thing about it is a um right here i made it's called bibinka it's like a filipino dessert cake it is made uh, with rice flour it um, it needed like um, butter or margarine. I didn't put any butter or margarine. I put sweet cream. Then um, it needed eggs, three eggs. I'm like, I don't know, how, I don't have any eggs, so no eggs. And they wanted like, they want and the, the recipe. They want like a cup of sugar. I didn't want to put any sugar. So instead of sugar, I put honey, and I put semi sweet like. Um, like a dark chocolate, semi-sweet, um, little morsel chocolate. And um, honey to sweeten it a little bit and the sweet cream on it. So it's like this. It's supposed to have kind of like a yellow tint to it because of the butter and the um, margarine or whatever in the eggs, but I didn't want to put any of those. I just want it as almost just like a consistency of a cake, but not overwhelming, like so sweet and me having some kind of weird jittery because it's too sweet. So that's one thing about it too. When I eat something way too sweet that's artificial, I get this weird jittery like I'm having coffee that it's not decaf. It's just the weirdest thing. And I get like nauseous. I know, it's, it's freaking weird. My body has been acting awkward. Then I put some coconut flakes. That was optional. I wanted to put some coconut flakes. It's unsweetened by um, this famous brand. I'm not going to mention because they're rich. They're not paying me to do it. Then um, instead of like regular oil, I put like um, a little bit of coconut oil. It's like... I didn't put, I didn't follow the recipe, um, recipe on it. Uh, all they had in that box was a pre-measure of um, rice flour. I didn't want to follow it because I didn't like the ingredients that they had on it. I wanted to just some kind of cake. <laughs> but I didn't have those ingredients, so I wasn't going to put that. But it tastes like a cake and pancake at the same time. No frosting, nothing. But when you bite to it, you can like hear the the texture of the um, coconut flakes. Yes, I'm eating this whole thing. I already ate like half of this thing already. I've been eating like nice and slow. My body's like, oh, thank you, thank you. It's much prettier. Like the pictures and like recipes here on YouTube. The recipes that I was looking at, you could have, you put in banana leaves. I have tons of banana leaves in the backyard, but I wasn't gonna get up at four o'clock, go outside and get banana leaves out. I mean, my backyard is pretty lit. We have a big, like um, security light in our backyard, just blazing. It shows my whole backyard. 
but I wasn't gonna get up there at four o'clock and get banana leaves and use it for my um, bibinga. It's called bibinga. So I, I have never bibing, made bibinga before, this dessert before, but I'm sure if I follow the direction, it would probably taste different, but it tastes more like a cake, pancake. So I made it into a healthier version. I'm not eating kind of vegetable or fruit today. It's just my cake. I'm going to eat this whole thing. I'm already so full. But I'm going to eat this nice and slow. I probably won't be able to eat the whole thing. And with that, I got white coffee. Nescafe, um... Instant coffee and decaf. You know how I know it's a decaf? The top is green. And it still tastes bad. <laughs> but it has that kind of coffee taste to it. It's a lot prettier on the sh pictures and the recipes here on YouTube. Look it up. It's called Bibinka. B I B I K A. Bibinka. It's the first time I made it. I didn't really follow the recipe. <laughs> but, you know, it's some kind of cake made of rice flour. So, it hits the spot. That's my interpretation of what a cake tastes like. It's been a long time since I had cake. So that, since I took that, I already ate half of it. I'm, I am full. I'm probably gonna pay the price for this. I'm probably gonna get bloated throughout the day. I am full. My body is happy and full. And I had enough. <laughs> um, I wonder what it tastes like if I actually followed the recipe that it says in the back, but didn't have half of the stuff. I basically just made like a thicker version of a pancake. But rice flour. Once in a while, I will eat rice. I will not be eating rice every day. I don't have any brown rice. I gotta find like a brown, um, rice flour. I don't know if there's such a thing, but uh, I'm full. I, this is what I'm having to, today and I will have my four bottles of water as well with a squeeze of lemon, lemon juice from a jar, not a jar, a plastic bottle. It never tastes any better. This decaf coffee is just awful. I love the taste of dark coffee. Nothing on it, just black. But decaf coffee is a different taste of disgusting. I'm not even kidding, it's just gross. But I can't drink just regular black coffee because it makes me so jittery. <sighs> giving my body rest from eating any kind of green products, any green veggies, anything vegetable. Just, I already feel bloated now. I think I'm gonna be regretting this by tomorrow. If I get so bloated tomorrow, tomorrow I will have some green juice for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. But at the same time, I feel like full at the same time, I feel happy and regretting it already. But it's good. One day, I will make the real recipe. <laughs> so, I don't know when it, that one day is, but I'm going to make the real one. But right now, I made pancake. Oh. They're still terrible. 
decaf. Nasty. Coffee is just terrible. But it's it's coffee. I gotta stop whining. This is my norm. <laughs> Anywho, it is six o'clock. Six thirty. It's probably almost six forty by now. It's kinda I think it's gonna be bright and sunny again. It's gonna be eighty something again today. Thank goodness for air conditioned. Nice and cool inside. You're not sweating. It just feels nice. Ooh, I feel bloated now. I think this is the first and the last I will be making bibinka. It's just, um, it's. It's too heavy, I guess, for my body to take. Now that I um, already ate like half of it, it's just, it doesn't feel good. It doesn't feel right. It was good to taste it, to have that little, tiny little semi-sweet, dark chocolate morsel. Then the crunch of the like um, coconut flakes, then sweetened with the honey. It's got that, that sweetness of it, it just like your body feels like awake and like <gasps> But the rice flour is just kind of like ugh It's just mm. It's not doing well <sighs> Maybe I eat too much of it because I already ate a half This is a like big circle I'm, I'm not sure how big this thing is This is not an actual plate, this is just like to bake a pie. I just like to use it because you can see everything. It's clear. I don't have any clear plates. I think this is to make like pies. I don't I think this is an eight inch pie dish. And I already ate like half. Look. That's it. Uh, I don't think I, I can't eat anymore. <laughs> uh, I, uh. Yeah, my body's regretting it now. <laughs> like I said, I baked it like at five and I just let it rest and just let it cool down. Then I laid some more and I went back to bed after I took it out of the oven, just kind of lay there hoping I can go back to bed. I did, I think, I closed my eyes for a couple minutes then I couldn't go back to sleep. Woke up again. Damn birds are chirping. I kid you not. Why are they so loud at such early in the morning? It feels like they're literally right to your window, next to your window, just to piss you off. They're just chirping so freaking loud and you're like, oh my God, let me get some sleep. I'm picturing it, they're just like, just facing towards my bed. Like there's a window, like literally. Right, my bed. My bed is like to the window. It's probably like three feet away from, the, no, maybe four and a half feet away from the window. I'm like facing it like so. They're like probably just outside the window like, hey, let's wake this crazy pe person. They're just chirping, I bet you, right there. They're just chirping so loud. Anyhow. I'm tired. I feel good as enough, but I'm tired and now I feel nauseous at the same time. Anywho, yeah. I'm gonna stop yapping. I'm gonna drink tons of water and flush this out. Oh, my body is not liking it. <sighs> 